The working principle of a baby incubator is based on creating a controlled and supportive environment that mimics the conditions of a mother's womb to ensure the well-being and development of premature or ill newborns. Here are the key components and principles involved in the operation of a baby incubator. Temperature regulation, heating system. The incubator is equipped with a heating system, often using a thermostat controlled heater. This system maintains a stable and warm temperature within the incubator to prevent hypothermia in premature infants who struggle with regulating their body temperature. Humidity control, humidifier. Many incubators include a humidifier to regulate humidity levels within the enclosed space. This is crucial for preventing dehydration in preemies as their skin is more permeable and they can lose moisture more easily. Oxygen supply, oxygen delivery system. In cases where a newborn may have respiratory difficulties, the incubator may be equipped with an oxygen supply system. This ensures that the baby receives the necessary amount of oxygen to support breathing. Monitoring system, sensors and monitors. The incubator is fitted with sensors to monitor vital signs such as heart rate, breathing rate, and oxygen saturation levels. These sensors continuously transmit data to monitors outside the incubator, allowing healthcare providers to track the baby's condition. Alarms, alarm system. To alert healthcare professionals to any deviations from normal parameters, the incubator is equipped with alarms. These alarms can indicate issues such as changes in temperature, low oxygen levels, or abnormal vital signs. Access and design. Accessibility. The design of the incubator allows healthcare professionals easy access to the infant for medical examinations, treatments and procedures without disturbing the controlled environment, portholes and doors. The incubator typically has small ports or doors through which medical interventions can be performed without compromising the internal conditions. Sterile environment. Barrier against infections. The incubator creates a barrier against external infections by maintaining a sterile environment. This is crucial for the vulnerable immune systems of premature infants. Light and sound control. Light dimming. The incubator may have a system to control the level of ambient light as premature infants are sensitive to bright light. Sound reduction. To minimize noise disturbances, the incubator may be designed to reduce external sounds. Adjustability. Customizable settings. The settings of the incubator are often adjustable to cater to the specific needs of each individual baby, considering factors such as gestational age, weight, and overall health. Portability and stability. Mobility. Some incubators are designed to be portable for easy transport within a healthcare facility. Stability. Ensuring that the incubator remains stable and secure is crucial for the safety of the infant. The combination of these elements in a baby incubator provides a carefully controlled and monitored environment, optimizing the chances of survival and healthy development for premature or ill newborns. Troubleshooting a baby incubator involves systematically identifying and addressing issues that may arise during its operation.